What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. What's good everybody, Jay with Lewis back at y'all with the prediction video, subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, any videos y'all want me to react to, hit me up, follow me on Instagram and threads at jlu 77 follow me on Snapchat, Hive, TikTok at jvlewis 77 check out my Twitch gaming channel, jvlewis as I stream on Xbox Series X, and check the members if you're interested in joining what I'm doing the prediction video for, it's WWE's Backlash, which is Saturday, it's in France, which means it's going to be super early on Saturday, I'm working, so I already know there will not be a live watch. I'll just catch it later. Hell, they'll mess around and be on, you know what I'm saying, while I'm at work. So I'll be checking here and there, seeing what's happening. So I'm going to do this prediction uh, video real quick. Um, I don't see much happening. Like, I just see one title uh, changing hands, you know. So uh, let's go ahead and get to it. So, and the title that I think is going to change hands is coming up. So we got the WWE's Women Tag Team Championships, the Kabuki Warriors versus Bianca Bella and Jay Cargill. We already know this is the end of damage control as they got drafted to Raw. So they're going to make Becky's life a living hell over there. But Bianca and Jay about to take the Tag Team Women's Tag Team Championships to new heights. And I guarantee you they're probably going to do some great booking with them as a champs because they got to be showcased regularly. You know what I mean? So... I expect Jade and Bianca. It's going to be a great match. They're going to really put this down. Coming up next, we got Randy Orton and helping out Kevin Owens versus the Bloodline, Solo Sequoia, and Tama Tonga. I'm going to go with the Bloodline to win this one. You know, you got to start these boys in their first match off strong. You know, we're going to see uh, Tama Tonga do his thing in the ring, but this is a long way from being over. They definitely going to... Uh, put it down but yeah the bloodline winning this one coming up next for the wwe women's championship we got bailey versus naomi versus tiffany stratton i've been liking this little thing naomi and tiffany stratton got going they pretty it's pretty much been on site ever since uh elimination chamber and it's like naomi see tiffany it's attack mode you know what i'm saying and tiffany she doing the prettiest moonsault ever on her and bailey a hey, bailey and naomi need to jump tiffany Put it out, and then they have it out. But I definitely see Bailey uh, winning this. Uh, the fact that all of these women, Tiffany, Naomi, Bianca, and Jade, all got drafted to SmackDown, like, they're going to see each other. So it's like Naomi and Tiffany definitely going to be continually in the title picture. You know what I'm saying? Especially the way the draft is, how the draft ended up. So uh, obviously with Nia, you know what I'm saying? Some people say Nia might get involved in this, making her statement because – Naomi and Tiffany keep getting involved in Naya stuff, and Naya keep at least putting uh, Naomi down. Uh, so we'll, we'll we'll see if Naya gets involved, but Bailey's going to retain. Coming up next, we got the WWE, we got World Championship, we got the World Heavyweight Championship, Damian Priest versus Jay Uso. Damian's retaining. Uh, it's going to be a good match, man. Jay's going to get some single gold at some point. I don't know when, but it's going to be a good match. But with Judgment Day, man, Damian definitely is a uh, Retain it. And finally, we got the Undisputed WWE Championship, Cody Rhodes versus AJ Styles. I can't believe this is the first time they've met. Not in TNA, not in Japan. Like, they just they just keep missing each other, you know. And I think this is going to be the match of the night, you know what I'm saying. Cody definitely going to retain. Uh, AJ, you know, he probably going to uh, get in his feelings. This, this, is, they, this is probably going to be a couple of matches in this feud. You know, AJ's probably going to attack Cody after the match, doing what he does, you know. And that's it. So, uh, who knows if they're going to spring any more matches at the last minute. Uh, I know SmackDown's going to be in France, you know. But right now, this is what they got on the website. So, to recap, uh, I got Bianca and Jay winning the WWE Women's Tag Team Championships. I got the Bloodline, uh, Solo Sequoia and Tama Tango winning over Kevin Owens and Randy Orton. I got Bailey retaining her uh, women's championship in a triple threat match. I got Damian Priest retaining his World Heavyweight Championship. And I got Cody Rhodes retaining the undisputed WWE Championship. So those are my predictions. Give me y'all predictions. Let me know what y'all think. Any surprises? Like I said, I don't expect much. I expect a, a good, you know what I'm saying, premium live event. But I'm not expecting anything shocking. So with that being said, subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. JB Lewis, y'all be safe out here. Catch y'all on the rebound.
Check out the Patreon. Hit the notification button. Check out the Twitch gaming channel. Check me out on TikTok. Check out the memberships. And I'll see y'all good people next video. Peace. Bye.